Ford's Theater and the house where Lincoln died in Washington, D.C. I'm Chris. I'm Tuffy. And today we're going to be showing you around this attraction in Washington, D.C. Behind me, this is Ford's Theater. This is where President Lincoln was assassinated. Admission is free. It's now operated by the National Park Service. Uh, but I recommend that you get a timed ticket. You can get these online or in advance from the ticket office. It's free the day of, but they go early. so pay three dollars and get one in advance and make sure you come in. There are essentially four main attractions. There is the theater itself. There's a museum underneath the theater. There's the house where Lincoln died. They brought him over from the theater to the house across the street uh, where he died the next day. And then there's another museum after you exit the house where he died. The tour begins inside Ford's Theater. It begins with a little presentation on the assassination and history of the theater. Uh, this theater is where Lincoln was shot. Uh, you can see the balcony where he was shot. It's actually not the original balcony because after his assassination, the War Department purchased the building to use essentially as an office building, uh, but it was renovated by the government in 1968 to be used as a theater once again. So what you see is a reconstruction of what it did look like like at the time of Lincoln's assassination. After visiting the theater, you can go down the stairs to the Lincoln Museum. This museum is located directly below the seats and stage of the theater. It's a museum all about Lincoln's presidency. Once you're done visiting the theater, walk across the street and check out the house where Lincoln died. Your ticket that got you into the theater will also get you into the house where he passed away. This is the slightly morbid part of the attraction. You get to go through the whole bottom floor of this house, ultimately ending up in this room, which is the room where Lincoln died, on this bed behind glass to the right. After you see the bedroom where Lincoln died, you head up to the fourth floor of the Peterson house to see an exhibit of Lincoln's funeral procession. Going down one floor is an exhibition about Lincoln's character and Lincoln the icon. This is my favorite part of the exhibition because it includes a display of Lincoln logs, the Lincoln instant disguise kit on the left, and on the right, the Lincoln slippers. Once you're done with this museum, you exit through a gift shop where you can pick up all sorts of Lincoln memorabilia, including President Lincoln playing cards, maybe even a Lincoln t-shirt. So if your travels bring you to Washington, D.C. and you want to learn some history about one of America's greatest presidents, check out Ford's Theater and the house where Lincoln died. And if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe or follow us on Facebook, Twitter, or Google+. See you. Bye-bye.